Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's Expresso right here on SABC3. We're talking design this morning. Now, can you teach computers to be imaginative? Can randomness make something emotive and meaningful? And what does this mean when it comes to design? Well, these are just some of the questions emerging. Uh, independent designer Daniel Ting Chong asked when conceptualizing the promotional campaign for the 2019 Design in Daba. That's taking place this week from Wednesday to Friday. Friday. So let's take a quick look at the campaign's animation. Wow, here we go. I'm here to share more about the design process behind this year's conference artwork is the man himself, Daniel Ting Chong. Daniel, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. So let's talk about this particular design process. Why did you decide to take this angle? Sure, so I'm an, I'm an independent designer and Design and Dive asked me to work on a campaign this year. And I was part of the Emerging Creative campaign um, with Design and Dive in 2017. Yeah. Uh, actually, much, actually, much uh, few years before that. Yeah. So they asked me to work on the campaign and I was truly honored. And there was an overarching a uh, theme about artificial intelligence, but support and how I could show that in like a logo or visual identity, yeah. which is quite hard to conceptualize. But what I really wanted to show was um, to take the human out of the design. Yeah. So we worked with a bunch of scripts and, and coding that actually um, drops the shapes into wow. different formats and they rely and fall, fall on one another to answer that question of support. Like, yeah. They, can, they all kind of fall into different angles, but they kind of make one image in the end. Yeah. Yeah. T talking about the, con the conferencing campaign materials, what were some of the inputs and parameters that you had when bringing this artwork to life? Well, it was kind of taking myself out of the equation, because yeah. usually when I approach an identity, yeah. I just choose all like the typefaces, the colors and everything. Yeah. Um, so this is actually shows you the process and how that works, where the computer will start choosing the shapes automatically by themselves. Wow. So here you can see the computer is importing the, the different selected shapes, which it just That's randomly incredible. chooses. Yeah. And then what it does, it drops the shapes into a format. Oh, wow. So it really takes myself out of the equation and rather lets the computer or the program design it in a way. Yeah. Um, as I didn't want to be dictative. So this obviously mimics AI, so it's not truly AI. Yeah. But this is a way that we try to approach it in quite a rudimentary way. Wow. Um, so we, everything is kind of unexpected. You don't know how the, the pictures are going to fall or yeah. what shapes it's going to choose. So yeah. each um, piece of design is actually really unique. That is um, amazing. That's wonderful. Now, I, I hear that you've created a little bit of a, uh, an animation for us as the Expressa presenters <laughs> yeah. and the Expressa, sh the Expressa show. I don't know if you've done it or if you've taken yourself out of the equation <laughs> like the last one. Uh, but can we take a little bit of a look at it? Sure, oh, yeah. my goodness. <laughs> it's really So did quick. you allow the, the computer to just let it all fall where it will? Yeah, so this is all happens organically. And wow. each, each image actually has a sound. So when you hear the animation play, um, there's different sounds attached to each picture. Oh, so organically, that would be the same process and how we approach the Design and Darbo campaign. That is fantastic. Well, Dion, you definitely are seeing, uh, you seeming to do the most right now. I mean, I've never experienced anything like this before. What can people expect this year at the Design and Darbo? I think there's like a huge misconception about creativity that it's only yeah. for people that can like draw really well or paint really well. And I think, yeah, the huge thing is that everyone's kind of creative and inside, like you can you can solve problems with creativity and thinking, yeah. creative thinking. And I think that's really important. But I think it's just opening your mind to different people outside of your discipline or that you would usually interact with that you can be like truly inspired by. Yeah. Wow, that is amazing. Truly inspirational stuff. Well done. Thank you well so done. Much. They picked the right guy for the job. <laughs> <laughs> and you can see more of Daniel's innovative work for the conference campaign, as well as gain some much more expertise, industry insight, networking, and entertainment by attending this year's Design in Daba, taking place from the 27th of February to the 1st of March at the Artscape Theatre Centre. For more information, you can go to designindaba.com.